You're watching Krem2 News at 5. Welcome back. You may know this firsthand. The flu mm. virus is spreading fast across the country. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says the flu is now widespread in 46 different states. Now that's nearly four times as many states compared to this time last year. This strain of the flu is H3N2 and it tends to hit children and older people harder than others. It's still too soon to say just how bad this flu season will end up being, but the CDC believes it could reach near epidemic levels. Yikes. The numbers in Spokane, the Spokane area, are much higher than usual. The Spokane Regional Health District says nearly 300 people in Spokane County have been hospitalized for the flu so far this season. Now compare that to last season where 315 people were hospitalized in Spokane County for the entire season. The flu season typically runs until March. The regional health district says a majority of the people hospitalized this season did not get a flu shot. Well, it may not have been the flu, but at some point over the past week, every single one of us mm -hmm. came down with the bug. Yeah, I'm convinced I had the flu. Yeah, me too. That's after hearing from Krim 2's health <laughs> reporter Rose Belt. She's breaking down the differences. If you are sick, it may be difficult to determine if you have the flu, a common cold or stomach virus. The flu and cold are both respiratory illnesses, but they are caused by different viruses. <laughs> the flu affects the lungs and sinuses. Flu symptoms come on suddenly and can include fever, cough, sore throat, runny or stuffy nose, muscle or body aches, headaches, and exhaustion or fatigue. A cold comes on gradually. Cold symptoms are usually milder than the flu symptoms. People with colds are more likely to have a runny or stuffy nose. Gastroenteritis is known as the stomach virus and is completely different from the flu virus. It is most often caused by Neurovirus, you've heard of that, known as the cruise ship illness, rotavirus or foodborne bacteria. Its symptoms include vomiting, diarrhea, stomach pain and cramping, and occasional fever. Adults rarely experience vomiting and diarrhea with the flu. Vomiting and diarrhea are more common in children with the flu. A stomach virus can be miserable, but it's typically not as serious as the flu. Finally, the flu symptoms may last anywhere from 2 to 10 days. If you have the flu, start feeling better for a few days and then develop worse symptoms with a higher fever, call your doctor. You may need a different treatment depending on your diagnosis. Rose Belt for Crime 2 News. Mm -hmm. All right, we are tracking breaking news at this hour out near the Freeman High School. Spokane County Fire District 8 firefighters say Highway 27 is closed at Elder Road. Yeah, this is bad. Crews say there are 20 to 30 different vehicles blocking there. We'll continue tracking this and bring you updates online and in our later newscasts as well. The storm uh, really hitting that area hard yeah. and just not letting up today. Right, kind of difficult to see from those pictures. What you can see, though, is coming down. It's snowing hard yeah, out there. Yeah, for sure. If you don't have to be on the road, don't. Don't go out there. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> All right, we don't.